Hai, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh My name is Daniel Kim Kazai Hai, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh My name is Haris Haikal Bini Syamuddin My name is number is DBA 21312 Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh uh, Nama saya Wan Alif Zikri bin Wan Nazri And Nombor matrix uh, DMS 213-008 Saya ambil kaos uh, Diploma in Office Management Today I'm going to talk about high self-esteem So what is high self-esteem? It refers to having a positive perception and belief about our, uh, ourselves, one's abilities and overall self-worth. Everyone have um, our self-worth, uh, self right? It means having confidence in oneself and feeling good about oneself, regardless of external circumstances. So, self-esteem is crucial because it influences uh, our thoughts, feelings and behaviors. When we have high self-esteem, we are more likely to take challenges, pursue our goals and uh, handle our failures and step back into a healthy way so bila kita dah jatuh mesti lah kita akan ada macam bad mindset kan so kita kalau kita ada high self esteem ni we can uh, get back our benda yang kita nak tu yang kita tak dapat tu kita boleh dapat balik apa yang kita nak so uh, itulah maksud yang uh, handle failures and step back in a healthy way ok untuk self high esteem ni yeah, they translate the number thing just Fable offers one examples to consider. Think about how you might react uh, react if you overheard someone making fun of your outfit uh, or the thoughts you shared in your lit literature class. If you have high self esteem, the teasing like likely uh, one bottle you much since it doesn't affect your internal perception of yourself. High esteem is all about respect and admiration. If you have high self-esteem, it means you like yourself when you say my estimate college you are saying you have nothing but the highest respect for you. Okay, maksudnya, harga dia adalah mengenai penghormatan dan kegaguman. Jika anda mempunyai harga dia yang tinggi, bagaimana anda menyukai diri anda sendiri? Apabila anda berkata akan sekerja saya yang dihormati Anda mengatakan bahawa anda tidak mempunyai apa-apa Selain penghormatan tertinggi untuk mereka So, high self-esteem also helps us to develop positive relation, uh, relationships with others And set healthy boundaries Moreover, low self-esteem can lead to a negative self-talk, self-doubt and a lack of confidence so, maksudnya yang ni kita cakap pasal siapa anyone yang ada low self esteem that can lead to uh, negative self talk so macam korang rasa oi dia ni buat lagi bagus dari aku so aku tak boleh jadi macam dia no everyone can do it semua boleh buat trust yourself kena percaya diri sendiri ada confidence untuk kita okay so this can result in miss opportunities so reduce quality of life and mental health issues such as anxiety and depression okay so um to maintain a uh, high self esteem to live and uh, to live a fulfilling life and achieve our potential some strategies to boost self esteem include practicing self compassion um challenging negative self talk setting achievable goals and surrounding oneself with positive and supportive people so if you want to naikkan lagi kita punya self esteem kan Takkan kita nak duduk dengan orang toksik Macam circle toksik Apa yang kita nak buat dia tak support Apa yang kita buat oh, Kalau misi tak boleh buat macam tu Macam ni kita nak dapatkan apa yang kita nak So I don't think so kita boleh buat But If you quit It's okay you want to stay with toxic people Just do it Let them talk Just prove it uh, Just prove, prove them wrong You can do it Now I'm going to talk about The most common characteristics uh, Of people with low self-esteem It's a lack of confidence People with low self-esteem often doubt themselves and their abilities and they might struggle uh, to believe that they are capable of achieve, uh, achieving their goals and they may also be uh, hesitate um, to take uh, on new challenges or try new things fearing and fearing failures or rejection so kalau macam Orang yang ada low self-esteem ni, yang dia tak confident dengan dia sendiri, mesti dia macam 
Uh, aku tak boleh buat ni Apa semua ni Takut nak cuba benda baru Ayo bagi contoh Contoh You guys nak open One Macam nak buka butik lah kan Lepas tu korang dulu macam Rasa macam Eh aku tak boleh buka ni Ada lagi banyak kedai lagi bagus dari aku Apa semua No Korang boleh buat lagi bagus dari kedai lain Fikir apa yang buat lagi menarik Apa yang boleh buat lagi kedai korang tu Butik korang tu lagi Menarik pada kedai yang korang rasa Dia punya Korang tak boleh lawan tu Boleh Just put a Great mindset ha, Jangan Rendahkan diri Janganlah merendah-rendahkan diri Tak bagus People with low self-esteem may experience emotional distress including feelings of sadness, anxiety and depression. They may have difficulty managing their emotions and may be prone to negative self-talk or self-criticism. So, macam ni susah lah. Macam, bukan susah dia macam teruk lah. Janganlah macam kau, uh, you merendah-rendahkan diri cakap uh, teruknya, I ni tak boleh buat ni, apa ni orang ni lagi bagus, negative talk dekat diri sendiri. Still macam kutuk-kutuk di sini No, cannot Tu yang buat you lagi low orang kata lagi Buat you lagi hilang semangat Lagi you tak boleh nak buat apa-apa Lagi you rasa macam you ni teruk No, cannot you Must fikir more positif To get yourself there You can do this Okay, so In conclusion, low self-esteem is uh, We can have a significant impact of uh, on our life Affecting our confidence, self-image, social interactions, and emotional well-being. If you are some, uh, if you or someone you know is struggling with low self-esteem, it is important to seek help and support to address these issues and improve your mental health and well-being. Remember, you are worthy, capable, and deserving of love and respect. Thank you.